I mean, it's just what you have to do to not sit in traffic for three and a half hours. Because the parking's horrible. Nearly everyone has a story about the traffic trouble at the Toyota Amphitheater. Music fans can take Highway 70 or 65 to get into town, but then rely on two lane country roads to get to the venue. We were tired, we were hot. Uh, we just really were sad that we were missing part of the show that we had looked forward to. Colleen was one of the thousands of people who had tickets to last night's Carlos Santana concert with the Doobie Brothers. And they warned us that it would be crowded and they said to leave early. Sweeney left her Fair Oaks home around 430, but got stuck in traffic just a few miles from the venue. From two miles outside the venue to our seat, two and a half hours. So we missed a good portion of the Doobie Brothers. Dozens of ticket holders turned to Facebook, posting their disappointment on the Toyota Amphitheater's page, saying some spent hours sitting in traffic, others saying they skipped the show altogether. I don't mind spending the money, um, but I think that the amphitheater owes us a better experience as customers. A spokesperson for the amphitheater says parking lots and venue doors opened early, and they started the concert 20 minutes late in an effort to give fans extra time to settle in. But for Colleen Sweeney, yesterday's traffic-filled trip to the Toyota Amphitheater will be her last. I made a promise to myself last night that that was the last time, no matter who they had, that I would not be back. It was just too stressful. And while traffic caused trouble for concert goers last night, it was smooth sailing today. With a smaller crowd, we didn't see any major backups ahead of tonight's show. In Wheatland, Emily Maha, KCRA 3 News.